I've been having the same dream lately. I'm running. I'm not sure whether it's a where to or what from situation. But it's dark and I can't stop. Grief manifests itself in different ways. I've noticed here that you've changed your emergency contact. How are your relationships going with your support network? Can't be too careful these days with everything they cut in the coke up within the city. <laughs> Remember the good old days when shit coke just meant that you'd have to do more of it? <laughs> hey Roy, I've been talking to that girl, Jenny. You know the one from WAC? She's cute, but she said her ex is a bit of a psycho. She used to run for a bit up north. I don't know why you're wasting time with girls like this, Eddie. See, that's the thing. I kind of wanted to ask a favor. I was hoping you could sell me a bag this weekend. Okay, Tony Montana. Since when did you start doing that shit? I mean, I don't. But I might have let it slip that I had a couple mates that were about it. So she asked me if I could hook it up. Listen. Any bitch just asking you for shit like this is bad news. You know, if you went to uni, you'd find a good girl by now. You're not my dad. I'm a man now. I'll call your mom auntie. She'd fucking kill me if she found out about this. Found out? How? Eddie, it's a no from me. At least for now. Listen, big man. I got an extra in the purse, though, man. It's yours if you're desperate, bro. Cheers, Jim. You're a lifesaver. Nah, don't mention it, man. I've been pretty well keeping to myself recently. Any drugs or alcohol? I mean, it's a battle, right? Talk on that. <laughs> I'd be lying to you if I said I was sober right now. Addiction is sometimes a symptom of an underlying issue. What do you think that issue is for you? I swear, I, I, I didn't do anything, man. It was five a second ago. I don't know what the fuck is happening. I... <sighs> Eddie, wake up, Eddie. This isn't fucking funny, man. Wait. I think we need a call. Shut the fuck up! Eddie, please wake up. Please. I'm sorry, Eddie. It's not your fault. I didn't say it was. You don't have to. But you need to know it wasn't. But we were family. We might have not looked like it, but we were brothers. It was my responsibility. Responsibility to do what? Care for another grown man. What happened, happened. You don't get into that life thinking there's an easy way out. I don't think I have the privilege of being as cavalier about the situation as you are. You need to be kinder to yourself, Roy. For your sake. And mine too. Roy, look, I've got some bad news. You've had a poor reaction to the treatment and uh, we're gonna need to keep you here a little bit longer. Most likely up the dosage of your antipsychotics.